Hi everyone, my name is Arjot and you are watching Ford Loves Gadgets. To a YouTuber, a subscriber means a lot. You guys give us the likes, subscribe the channel, watch our videos, give us the watch time and what not. Apart from that, you also give us suggestions which we use to make our videos too. Hence, I firmly believe that this relationship is to and fro and should not be one-sided despite giving you the videos a subscriber gives a YouTuber in back a lot. Having said that, though we are at a nascent stage, but I have decided that we'll do a small giveaway. Now this giveaway is of Rink plus Capover or XUNND cover. And two, as far the video is concerned, if you have not been aware of it, we buy these devices and then review them rather than these being review units. Having said that, we have now got the hands on the Realme X I know we are late to the party, but as they say, better late than never. So we'll start with the Realme X unboxing and first impression, and then I'll let you know the giveaway. Now, just to give you a hint, this giveaway would not have any subscriber limit, would not have any uh, views limit. It would be a pure giveaway, which will definitely happen. So stay tuned. Let's watch the unboxing and then I'll reach to the giveaway and I'm sure you're going to like this. On this note, once again, Please do subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for all. Like the video, comments, let us know your feedback, share the video with your friends and family and thanks a lot for all the love that you've given so far. So let's start. So guys, here is our Realme X. Let's quickly unbox it. A quick look at the box. On the top, Realme X pop-up generation. Here you can see the camera, screen size, weight, the price which is 17999 and the content which is phone, charger, USB data cable, SIM ejector tool, safety guide, quick guide and protective case. And some other information manufactured by and manufactured for. Now the screen is pretty big, it's 6.5 inches so it's gonna be a big phone. Battery is 3765, I think 4000 would have been better considering the screen size but then it's AMOLED. Now this is the polar white version, the RAM is 4GB and ROM is 128GB and this is made in India which is excellent. Now let's quickly open it up and have a look at the phone. Okay, as usual, greeting to the user, hey welcome to Realme family, I'll keep this here. Here is our phone, wow this is a big phone, I mean my palm is of decent size to be very honest it's quite big I won't gonna able to operate it wow this is a big phone I'll keep it here as well now you get the book charger which is excellent this is the best part of realme device the book charger and followed by the cable itself now if we look into this, you get your case, Just first you get the SIM ejector tool, some booklets and this case as well. So I'll just keep it here, let's put this here as well and here it says let's embrace a new journey. So it's good that they want to give that touch. Now this cover is good guys the best thing is that it's on the you know darker side as in i'll just take this off now if i have a look at it one it groovy inside so as to give better grip and i mean it's a lot better than what we have seen before moreover this phone gonna turn yellow which is the best part so here is the phone guys let's take off the wrapper and have the first in hand feel okay likewise i mentioned it's a big phone it looks chunky and it feels chunky as well there's a weight to it let's quickly check how much does it weighs so i'll just turn this on turn off the light and 197 so realme says that it weighs around 199 191 grams so it's similar to that okay now 
at the bottom you basically get the usb type c port speakers 3.5 mm jack noise cancellation power on of button sim tray pop-up camera front camera noise cancellation and volume down and low key there is a tempered glass pre-installed i think this is something every manufacturer should do i was surprised when on k20 pro i did not find it and trust me for them it would not gonna cost more than a rupee so i think this is something every manufacturer should do that they should equip their phones with a tempered glass now let's talk about the build quality of the phone as far the build quality is concerned the phone is made of polycarbonate i agree it's polycarbonate but it feels and looks really nice unless you pick it up and even if you pick it up you'll not be able to say that it's polycarbonate the yellow touches on the phone looks really good whether it's a rear camera or the button it looks really nice overall i like the build quality would like to mention that despite polycarbonate or glass back they both have the pros and cons this would be more shock proof and drop proof as in it would not gonna break or shatter wherein glass would but then it would be more prone to scratches also important thing is that on this the covers that you'll buy would not be as expensive as you would like to buy on the glass back because you would like to ensure that if a glass back phone is dropped the glass doesn't break or shatter so that's another advantage to it on this note let's move to the display it's super amulet display that realme has given in the realme x let's talk about performance as far realme x is concerned it's equipped with snapdragon 7110 which is clocked at 2.2 gigahertz and is based on 10 nm technology now this is a ai processor also supporting this is the gpu 616 and the performance is really smooth day to day activities and gaming would not be a problem as far the entry to score is concerned it's also great supporting this package is a beefy battery which is of 3765 mah the best part of it is that it comes with hook charger 3.0 which is provided out of the box it can charge 50% of the battery in just 30 minutes isn't that amazing guys the phone also gets the wide wind l1 certification out of the box it comes with lpddr 4x ram and also usf 2.1 storage The phone supports dual nano SIM. Unfortunately, you cannot expand the memory and it comes with Bluetooth 5.0. All the important sensors are present on the phone, so you would not gonna face any problem with respect to sensors as well. The phone comes in two variants, 4 GB RAM and 128 ROM and 8 GB RAM and 128 ROM. At the rear, you get two cameras. The first rear camera is the 48 megapixel Sony IMX586 which comes with f1.7 aperture. It also comes with PDAF. It's supported by the 5 megapixel depth sensor, which is f 2.4. Now the front camera is basically the Sony IMX 471. It's a pop-up camera with aperture f 2.0, and it's very fast and very quick. It captures good pictures, but we'll see how does it performs in the initial impression. As per the latest update the option to turn on the 48 megapixel camera has now been moved to the front panel in the camera interface rather than going into the settings and then changing it from there which is really convenient. Let me have let me show you how. So as you can see it's showing up here as well right and you can see it says ultra 48 mp. So this is really great and trust me this shows that Realme is listening to the feedback very keenly and even faster they are implementing the solution so realme thumbs up for that it's a great phone available at a great price the hardware that it packs super amulet display fast fingerprint scanner fast face unlock super fast charging or i'm not against with xiaomi but then this is something that i expected from the redmi k20 pro as well which i bought and reviewed as well that's what speed is all about trust me try it somewhere in a boutique and you will be surprised you will br- it will bring a smile to your face how fast it works the performance is good the amoled panel is good yes it's of polycarbonate but then as i mentioned it has its own pros and cons on that note i'll now come to the giveaway part and i'll share my review later on for this phone as i am liking it a lot now let's talk about giveaway which probably might be holding you so far to watch this video <laughs> as far the giveaway is concerned this is something we want you to run and we generally want to do it hence we are not making it a conditional 
there is no limit we are keeping for the subscribers so you know no matter five people subscribe post this 10 people subscribe post this 100 people subscribe post this we will do this giveaway there is no limit to the number of views even 500 views 1000 views 1500 views will do the giveaway now the options for the giveaway are three ring covers number two one ring cover and four capable transparent cover and number three one ring cover and four xu and nd covers i'll pick up feedback from the first 50 comments basis what you suggest and we'll do that only because we want you to run this giveaway now in order to be eligible for this is just that you have to subscribe the channel make sure you do follow us on facebook twitter and instagram that's the only condition and of course when you comment in the video of this as in uh, the winner that we'll pick from make sure you put your name and email address properly in this video so that once we choose the winner we contact them and we reach out to the right address as far the winners are concerned let's say if we go the option first wherein we choose three ring cover we'll pick up five winners in case anyone doesn't reply we'll move on to the next one in case you know nobody replies i mean for that purpose it will stand cancelled but i think the chances are very less on that note guys we are at a nascent stage uh, but still we want to do this because it's your love and you know support that has you know taken to this level and i think we are equally responsible to give that love back to you as well and as we grow trust me fatte chak dange ik to ik vadiya giveaway hoega tusi yaad rakhoge ki yaar papa ji nal deal kita si on that note it's a wrap Please do subscribe the channel, hit the bell icon, do like the video, share it with your friends and family, comment, make sure you take part in this giveaway. Last but not the least, keep sharing your feedback guys. I love it. And we are trying to set up a little more professional, you know, area for these videos. Hope you like it. Let's hope it finish soon. Take care. Jai Hind. The camera interface is really crisp. With the recent update, the option to use 48 megapixel has been moved to the left icon, the three bars as you can see. Also on the top you can see you can toggle the resolution of which you want to make the video. In some phones you have to get into the settings to change that. Also the good thing is that from here only you can turn the flash on or off wherein in some case you have to stop the video. Once again, good job. So guys, this recording is being done by Realme X and the audio is recorded by Realme X. Now you can clearly see that the EIS is good. I'm just moving now and I have just rotating the camera quickly. Now EIS only comes at 1080p, not beyond that. One thing I must say is that the aperture is great. It can actually gather a lot of light, but then there is a white balance issue as you can clearly see. See that green tint, right? So that's because of the white balance issue. The track is basically grey in colour as in it's not greenish that it's being showing us.